Have you ever wondered why India, a country once known primarily for its rich cultural heritage and diverse traditions, is now making headlines for its vibrant startup culture? Well, you're not alone. Over the past decade, India has experienced an extraordinary boom in startup culture, transforming the nation into a breeding ground for innovation and entrepreneurship. Cities such as Bengaluru, often referred to as the Silicon Valley of India and Pune, have emerged as the epicenters of this boom. These hubs are nurturing startups in a wide array of sectors, from technology to e-commerce and fintech, thereby reshaping India's economic landscape. This shift is not just about numbers, it's about a change in mindset, a new wave of Indian entrepreneurs who are not afraid to dream big and take risks. In the midst of this startup boom, there are a few that have managed to outshine the rest. One such story is that of Zomato, a food delivery platform that started from scratch and is now a household name in India. In the bustling streets of New Delhi, two tech enthusiasts, Deepinder Goyal and Pankaj Chatta, found themselves in a predicament. They noticed a gap in the market, people were craving a simpler way to order food from their favorite restaurants. From this realization, the seeds of Zomato were sown. Starting as a simple website called Foodie Bay in 2008, they focused on providing restaurant menus for customers to browse. However, they didn't stop there. They saw a bigger picture, a broader vision, to transform the way India eats. The duo hustled, they innovated and they adapted, rebranding to Zomato in 2010 and expanding their services to include online ordering and food delivery. The journey, as you can imagine, was not a walk in the park. The early days were marked by numerous challenges, from acquiring the first hundred restaurant partnerships to convincing customers to trust an online platform for food delivery. However, with every stumbling block, they found a stepping stone. They were relentless in their pursuit and unwavering in their belief. Fast forward to today, and Zomato is nothing short of a success story. It's a platform that serves millions of customers across hundreds of cities in India and beyond. It has grown from a simple idea to a company that employs thousands and continues to innovate in the food tech sector. But the journey doesn't end here. Zomato continues to evolve, to grow, and to reach new heights. They plan to expand their services to delve into new markets and to continue making food more accessible to everyone, everywhere. Zomato's journey is a testament to the fact that, with a unique idea, relentless hard work, and a little bit of luck, one can transform a simple startup into a successful enterprise. The rise of startups in India is a story of transformation, innovation, and entrepreneurial spirit. This narrative is not just about the birth of new businesses, but it's also about the birth of a new India, an India that is technologically advanced, innovative, and entrepreneurial. We've seen how the Indian startup ecosystem has boomed over the past few years. Cities like Bengaluru and Pune have not just witnessed this change, they've been the flag bearers of it. They've fostered a culture of innovation and entrepreneurship and in doing so, they've changed the very fabric of the Indian economy. The sectors leading this change are diverse. Technology, e-commerce and fintech are at the forefront, but they're not alone. We're seeing innovation across the board, in sectors ranging from agriculture to education, from healthcare to entertainment. Each of these sectors is being transformed by startups, each in their own unique way. But what does it take to build a successful startup? It's a journey. A journey that involves identifying a problem, coming up with an innovative solution, and then executing on that solution. It requires perseverance, hard work, and a never-say-die attitude. It's not always easy, but the rewards can be immense. Innovation and entrepreneurship are at the heart of this journey. They're the driving forces behind the startup boom. Innovation allows us to come up with new solutions to old problems, while entrepreneurship gives us the courage to take risks and chase our dreams. It's this combination of innovation and entrepreneurship that is creating a new India, an India that is forward-thinking, dynamic, and entrepreneurial. As we continue to delve into this fascinating world of startups, we are constantly amazed by the innovation, the creativity, and the sheer determination of the entrepreneurs driving this change. It's an exciting time to be part of this journey, and we can't wait to see what the future holds. As we continue to witness the evolution of India's startup culture, one can't help but wonder, what's next?